Life's Work, A Moral Case for Choice. I'm Susanna Woodhead, and this is Bookmarks. Hello and welcome to Bookmarks. I'm your host, Susanna Woodhead. Was Hinipero Serra responsible for the abuses of the California missions? I'm Susanna Woodhead, and this is Scholar's Mate. Freedom and security, the Second Amendment, and the right to keep and bear arms. I'm Susanna Woodhead, and this is Bookmarks. I think he's asking you, when is a woman no longer a person? Uh, he stated earlier, I, I believe, and you can correct me, we're having a little bit of trouble uh, hearing you, but um, I believe he stated that um, that when does a woman's rights end? When is she sure. no longer a person sure. in reference to the child that's sure. inside of her? All right, let's take some questions from our viewers. So for our first question, uh, we have Sylvia Austin has asked, if one person starts shooting at random in public, and then another starts shooting, and then another, how does anyone know who the good guys and the bad guys are? Dr. Lott, could you expound on that? Yeah, thanks. All right, let's take some questions from our viewers. Brent Yates asks, should gun manufacturers be held to the same standards as other companies? And I'll go ahead and start with you, Ala. The issue of guns has been a constant struggle in America. With each mass shooting, there are renewed calls for stricter gun control, which in turn results in more gun sales and vigorous defense of gun rights and the Second Amendment. Scott McPherson of the Future Freedom Foundation has weighed in on this debate with his new book, Freedom and Security, The Second Amendment and the Right to Keep and Bear Arms. Mr. McPherson joins us today via Skype. He is a policy advisor at the Future of Freedom Foundation and an advocate of the Free State Project. He lives in Portsmouth, New Hampshire. And joining us to critique the book is James Hedrick. He is a federal government contractor and a PhD candidate in political science at Rice University. He has served as a legislative fellow in the U.S. Senate, a presidential management fellow with the Department of Housing and Urban Development, an agricultural lobbyist, and a Democratic campaign staffer. Gentlemen, thank you both for joining us. Thank you, Susanna. Thank you. Okay, that's all we have time for. Thanks to both our guests, Jonathan Cordero of California Lutheran University and Ruben Mendoza of California State University, Monterey Bay. And thank you for watching Scholars Mate. I'm Susanna Woodhead. We'll see you next time. And thank you for watching Scholars Mate. I'm Susanna Woodhead. We'll see you next time.